What is going on ladies and gents? How are you guys doing? Back again with another FIFA 20 video. Right now I'm doing FIFA 20 career mode and as you can see the squad that I'm playing as here is AZ Alkmaar and most of the players are 70 rated or above and this is a pretty decent Eredivisi squad. This is the standard AZ Alkmaar squad and I chose AZ Alkmaar just because they've been one of the most impressive teams in the Eredivisi lately and one of the most exciting teams but uh, anyways this is a, a little video that I'm doing here just to show you guys how I did with these a, with this AZ Alkmaar squad. So starting off, we're going to be playing here in the uh, Invitational European in International Cup. So the teams we're going against are Rio Ave FC, uh, Norwich City, and FC Dusseldorf. Right now we're going to be playing against Norwich City, and we're going to see how we can do here. And uh, actually, I did pretty decent here in the group, and I'm going to show you guys in a bit. Right here in the 35th minute, I win a penalty for my team. And speaking of penalties this year, taking penalties in FIFA this year has been kind of a big challenge for me. But nonetheless, here I was able to win my team a penalty. So right now, we have an opportunity to score our first and ever goal. And right here, I'm deciding where I should shoot the penalty, and I decided to shoot it into the bottom left corner. The player that I'm using here to take the penalty is called Idrisi, that's his last name, and I decided to use him, as you can see, I netted the penalty in, but this guy here has 82 pens for AZ Alkmaar, so if you're playing as AZ Alkmaar, I highly suggest using Idrisi, since his penalty taking is 82, which means that that's going to increase your chances of netting in a penalty, but right here my teammates are celebrating, and let's take a look at that penalty replay, I perfectly was able to bury the ball and sent the keeper the wrong way. Right over here I try to contain... Norwich here, but they get across and one of their guys scores an equalizer. So it's 1-1 right now I was very frustrated just because of my defense I don't know what my defense was doing right there But they left that player completely unmarked right there and by the time they were trying to prevent a goal It was too late. So Amadou scores the equalizer for Norwich City and now it's 1-1 So I got to try and find a way to get back into the game Right over here, I was able to find Stangs wide open since I found a gaping hole in Norwich City's defense. And right here, I finished the ball into the net to make it 2-1 for AZ Alkmaar in the 76th minute. So now it's the dying minutes of the game. Last second, desperate attempt at Norwich City trying to get an equalizer. But over here, I was able to find a way to prevent the equalizer. And I was just going to kick the ball towards the goal area of Norwich City in order to prevent any more comebacks. And we are able to preserve a win for AZ Alkmaar. In game two against Fortuna Dusseldorf, I win a corner here and Vlar soon makes it 1-0 for AZ Alkmaar with a splendid strike into the top left corner. Soon I make it 2-0 for Alkmaar. Right here is where Dusseldorf managed to find a goal. I try to prevent them from gaining any space but their uh, player's pace was just too much for my defense and my defense couldn't keep up with the player's pace and soon it's going to be 2-1 to one here and I don't know what happened right there but that was such a big hole my defense left so it's 2-1 to one right now. For some reason the recording cut out for the second for the third goal so here's the fourth goal from Idrisi and so far Idrisi has been very impressive so far in my team and I've been very impressed with this guy's performance because of his pace and his finishing ability. And over here I had another banger with Idrisi well it was really a tap in but I finished off the game with a 5-1 victory over Dusseldorf. In the third game, I'm going against Rio Ave FC, and over here I managed to find Idrisi on a through ball, and right here we do a nice little build-up to open up the scoring for AZ Alkmaar. I was looking to find a space, and I managed to find Boad Boadu, and he makes it 1-0. Over here, I make a nice little counter-attack by hitting Rio Ave with a long through ball, and Idrisi is going to make it 2-0 for Alkmaar. As it is the 77th minute here, I make it 3-0 with another beautiful banger into the top corner. And this is the ending of the game where Alkmaar win 3-0. Now I'm going here against Letza in the semifinals and they are able to get past my defense and they make it 1-0. I don't know what it is but I really am a big fan of Idrisi so far in this career mode series mainly because he gets past their defense and he perfectly finishes that into the top right corner in order to get the equalizer. Over here, this is my favorite part of the game when Mitsio makes it 2-1. I don't know if that's how you pronounce his name, but he scores a nice little banger into the bottom corner in order to preserve a 2-1 lead for Alkmaar. Look at that great build-up, managed to find a space there, and beautiful goal. And for some obscure reason, I somehow stupidly lose possession of the ball here and lets him make it 2-2. So at this point, I'm like, damn it, we're going to have to go to extra time and they get the rebound here. And this is the part of the game where I score a dramatic goal in the dying seconds of the game in order to advance to the final. So right here, I begin the counterattack from Idrisi, who passes to 
Uweyan, and this is kind of similar to the Belgium, to the way how the Belgium Japan game ended in the World Cup. And look at Bowadu, he's out in the open, nobody can catch up to him, and he makes it three to two. The last part right here made me really nervous because I really just wanted to end this game, and I was able to end this game here. And he does a nice little cartwheel celebration here, and this is one of my favorite ways to win games in FIFA is just by scoring last second dramatic goals. And I'm pretty sure everyone hates it sometimes losing like that. You know, I hate losing like that too, but winning like that is gives you such an awesome feeling. Look at that beautiful. I think goalkeeper got a touch on that, and it just deflects into the net. Coincidentally, we are going against Norwich City here, and Bowadu does a nice little spin move here to open up the scoring for Alkmaar. Five minutes into the second half, I make it 2-0 with a funny way to score. Goalkeeper tried to come off his line, but the ball just sailed into the net. So far, the counterattacks for Alkmaar have been absolutely amazing to execute in career mode here. And right over here, I have tons of space. And soon it's going to be 3 0. Nobody is covering this area. So I just shoot the ball into the net. And it's 3 0 for Alkmaar. Now that Alkmaar won the game 3 0, as you can see up on the scoreboard, that was the final score of the game. And right over here, they just raised the trophy. So this is Alkmaar's first and ever trophy of the season. And I chose to accept. The participation just because you you get a couple of extra money that you can use to spend on some players and hopefully I can get some good players to come to Alkmaar and help them win possibly the Europa League or Champions League but anyways guys let me know what you thought about this video if you enjoyed this leave a like comment subscribe